Welcome to Michael's Welcome to Michael's Beer Review. Tonight I'm reviewing a stout boots wine chocolate stout Trader Joe's beer. Um it's, it's like $1.99 for this. It was a decent price. Been sipping on it, looks like a stout. And as a stout. Yeah, I got that dark roasted smell. Yeah, some sweetness, some hops, dark chocolate. Cheers. Boots wine. Boots wine. Chocolate stout. What's the percentage? 5.5 alcohol. I've been sipping on it. It's, it's, it has some chocolate taste to it. Roasted espresso taste. It has a, again, roasted malt. It's no... Bitter in the mouth. It doesn't have a like an ashy taste like some stouts do, which I don't like. This is really really good for the tip, for the price. Um, but oatmeal stout. What's Trader Joe's oatmeal stout? Um, Stockyard. I like that a little better, but this is just as good. This is up there. This is good for for a decent price beer. Very good. Might be excellent. It's a. It beats a lot of a lot of. Uh, big time, big price, high price stouts and porters from micro micro breweries. This do this it has a good taste. Again, it has a chocolatey taste, not overly chocolatey. You can taste some. It's still watery. It has a little medium, not really over carbonation. Is not overly carbonated? I definitely buy this again. Ah. Uh, have I had stouts better, cheaper? I, I like Trader Joe's. It's an oatmeal stout, but Trader Joe's oatmeal stout's better than this. What else is better? You know, Samuel Smith, their stouts are better. So, some uh, Bell's is a little bit better, but this this is up there. And the price is cheaper than Bell's and cheaper than um, not cheaper than um, Samuel Smith for sure. I give it a a very ninety three. Very good, not not world class, but for for beer, you want dark beer, Trader Joe's beer, this is it. This is, I'd go here or you want to get a six pack, buy their uh, stockyard stout because it's not bitter, it's smooth as you can be. It's smooth, it has a little ashiness at the end. That's what brings it down a little, the the score. But it's very good. It's not world class. I, I think Stockyard is, is higher. It is higher. It has a, I would rate it higher. Almost world class. I'd take Stockyard a lot of, over a lot of Stockyard Trader Joe's for six ninety nine. I'd take it over most micro beers and um, craft beers at nine ninety nine, ten ninety nine, and six pack. But this is just up there. It only comes in this uh, this uh, what's an ounce? Probably 30, 30 ounce. Again, A, very good. I'd recommend it for sure, especially if you're hurting, if you want a dark beer. Go here. Go Trader Joe's. Trader Joe's, half their beers, probably more than half are excellent for the price. They beat most micro beers and um, beat most uh, craft beers, especially for the price. A lot of Trader Joe beers beat craft beers just on price. The taste can be... 5% difference, but your price is like 30%. So you're getting 5% less of a tasting beer, less quality beer for 30% more money you're going to pay. So just think about that. This is excellent for what it is. Not a, it's, it's not excellent, but here's what it is. It's very good. Try it. Thanks for watching. Comics, questions. Do you like Trader Joe's beer? Do you think they're overpriced? You think you think do you, you do you go there? Go try them out. Most people don't go go to Trader Joe's. You only can buy six packs. You could you can um you can you can do mix six packs and they only charge you a higher price. Like some stores will charge you a higher price for a, a single. Like like it's five ninety nine a six pack. They charge you a one fifty for a single. Trader Joe's doesn't do that. That's what, one good thing about Trader Joe's. You can mix and match and taste beers. Especially this one, $1.99 is uh, 
for a bottle of this, can't beat it. Um, thanks for watching. Again, comments, questions. Bye.